know it's a helical. So what that in effect does is it feeds spin symmetry to the surface of a grid. This is grid engineering 101. That the more axes of symmetry that can be superposed at one time, the more the soap bubble reduces the copy, which is the immune system of the Earth's grid. So the frequency harmonics of multiple axes of symmetry create a grid and soap bubble that does not pop. So that's called Gaia's necessary oxygen. And this is from anti-gravity in the world grid by Becker and Hagen. And even at that time, ancient times, the dodecahedron was seen as the key to the lock of the grid itself. So this ability to embed is how you got into the grid. The combination of the ecosta and the dodeca made this geometry possible. So the dodecahedron becomes the foundation stone of Steiner and the symmetry of DNA versus Earth grid and zodiac. This is the early star mother model. This is the 15 great circles and three of the Arabro Yopeno Angel grid. Three circles per cube, five cubes per dodeca, so 15 great circles in perfect symmetry. So here's how you begin. You find the magnetic cross in the land and you enact it in stone. Later that becomes the labyrinth. The labyrinth is sometimes implicit and not explicit in Native American stone circles. So what is your stone structure doing? Here's an example of a stone structure. It's called ex cathedra, or cathedral for short. Ex cathedra means from the chair, which is from the place of leverage. So the chairman is the one at the cathedra. Chairman is the one who has access to the magnets of the earth. We come to the word catheter, which means access to blood and catheter which comes from the word kappa, which is very kappa, okay, which is the place where the magnetic blood of the land is unpacked. And what you're suggesting to notice here, as you're looking at the cathedral of Machu Mandir, the mother in Orlando in India, what does it look like? Look at here. Look at that picture. Now look at this picture. This is a virus. See how the virus gets access to the blood? It does it with a screwing motion. The virus is mostly DNA. The DNA comes down here and screws itself through the cell membrane. The cell membrane, the cell membrane gets screwed. And the result is penetration. That's what a cathedral does. It screws its way into the grid. Now, the grid doesn't mind giving up a little bit of its blood. It's going to create a structure that can serve Gaia. So the first thing that has to happen to make it cathedral is to make the earth bleed. Which is what happens when you raise a sword from stone. The S word is the S word. Get the line from the circle. That's what the jet, the raising of the jet, is called. The one who can do it is called the Jedi. And this 